string of beads. Which number is indicated up to 10? On the screen, you see a string of beads. If you look closely, you will first see five red beads, and then five black beads, and then five red beads, and then five black beads again. You can count them for yourself. One, two, three, four, five. In a string of beads, you will always see five red beads and then five black beads. Let's see what we have to do. We have to count up to the arrow. If we count one, two, the answer to this question is that two beads are indicated up to the arrow. Now let's try a different problem. We see the arrow again, and we need to count up to this arrow. We can count everything. One, two, three, four, five, and six. So, the answer to this question has to be six beads are shown up to the arrow. But this could be achieved more easily. Because we know that there are always five red beads, and then five black beads, so we can try to do it more quickly with the next problem. Now, we are going to do this problem fast. We know that we already have five red beads. So we are not going to count the red beads. We are just going to count forward from five. We start with the black bead, which is one more than five. So six, seven, and eight. The answer to this question is that eight beads are indicated up to the arrow. Let's try one more. Look, you can easily see how many beads are shown up to this arrow. We don't have to count everything, like one, two, three. We can just know that there are already five red beads and five black beads. So five and five. So the answer to this question must be 10 because five plus five equals 10. Congratulations for finishing this problem, and I hope to see you again soon.